Hello there, Scorpio. It's me, Lex. Welcome to your general reading. If you have not already, please subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you're notified when I do post new content. Keep in mind that this channel is geared and catered specifically to those with the sign and placements of Scorpio and their cross watchers. OK, if you are looking for um, videos and readings that highlights other signs, um, other motivational and coaching videos, check out my main channel that is Prophetic Lex and take a view or a walk over to the community tab because I do post constant promotions and sales in the community tab um, at least once a week, okay? All right, so I've already pre-shuffled and drawn your cards. I'm going to go through how they came out and then rearrange and clarify as necessary, okay? So first we have the Four of Pentacles. We have the Page of Pentacles. King of Wands, Page of Swords, Ten of Wands, and the Ace of Swords. Crowning the overall energy of your reading is yes. Oh, and perfect timing. All right, Scorpio. So I feel that some of you, um, you're a little bit tight with your money or um, maybe tight with your feelings. I wasn't really trying to read this as a love reading but it can fit in that situation apply this how it fits if it fits it's not going to fit every time okay because this is general but what i am seeing though is that um you may have been either tight with your money or your feelings you may be feeling like pulling back um some sort of support maybe cutting back some um like monthly subscriptions i know i had to do some of that recently but there is still messages and opportunities that are coming in. They're not substantial. This isn't a queen or a king, but this is news of something that is going to allow you to boss up and take over and give you um, the chance to uh, implement some new ideas that you've been having. OK, also, some of you, I feel that you uh, may be receiving um, a message soon that um, may kind of put a damper on some things page of swords is a message via text um, online email something like that so you may have applied for a job that you really hoping that you're going to get and you may not get it possibly um, a lover may have to cancel plans with you um, this weekend 10 of wands this is burdens stress related could be health related you could have um been set back because you were under the weather recently but i do feel that whatever you were going through is coming to an end okay we're going to clarify a little bit further some of you scorpios you could be involved with a king of wands energy that is fire aries leo sagittarius page of pentacles is earth uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and Source is air. Uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Okay, all of that is on the table right now. What should Scorpio do going forward? What should Scorpio do going forward? Okay, Scorpio, so... <clears throat> Okay, so with the Knight of Wands, I do feel this is telling you full speed ahead. Go on with your plans. There is a vision that you have and everybody and everything is not going to be able to go on this journey, on this trip. OK, if you plan a trip with someone, they may not be able to go. That's why I was saying your partner may have to cancel something with you that's coming up. Don't fight about it. Don't argue about it. Understand that, especially when it comes to business and career, everyone does not have your vision, okay? So halt on any arguing, any fighting, any conflict that has arisen within yourself or with someone else. Stop that, halt that, take what you can, and then just go on forward. Take what you have and just go on forward. If you wanted to include someone on like a business opportunity and they're like finicky about it, that's okay. Leave they ass behind. Oh, well, all right, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to pull a life purpose oracle message for you. We have oracle cards. You are able to discern answers and guidance for yourself and others. 
We have builder. Your innate ability to build and create brings you a deep sense of accomplishment. And we have counseling. You heal with your kind words, wise advice, and empathetic ear. Some of you may be creating a spiritual business where you do something similar like what I do, the coaching and the readings. Okay. And that's great. Um, it may be, you may be an actual counselor and you are maybe starting your own practice. When it comes to builder, you may be physically building things, but this is more about the creation side. You could be a content creator. You could be um, a web designer. You could be, uh, you may be designing your own Oracle cards, something like that. All right. And you need to continue doing that. That is your gift. That is your talent. It will make room for you. And then this, if this up here was related to a business situation, this new opportunity is going to allow you to build and create that business and that life um, that you have been wanting. OK. All right. So I'm going to pull a couple of romance angel oracle messages just to tap in on the love side of things for you, Scorpio. Tap, tap, tap in. Scorpio in love. Love advice for Scorpio. Love advice for Scorpio. Scorpio, we have unrequited love. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. Religious factors. Your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path. Retreat. It is time to disconnect from the world. And we have attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Okay. This is what I was saying about um, everyone's not going to be able to take a journey with you. It could be that spiritually you are evolving and the person that you are with is not picking it up. They're not wanting to uh, participate in what it is you're doing. They don't get it. They don't want to go. And it is okay to leave them behind okay don't worry about what has been don't worry about what could be take a step back and enjoy this moment live in the present okay those are my scorpios who are experiencing something like this and you are married enjoy this moment okay we are even married are constantly changing growing and evolving and it takes time for your partner to um you know, accept the change in us. OK, you're not going to always be lovey dovey. You're not going to always like each other. You're not going to always want to be physical with them. OK, but you choose every day to love who you love. And those are my Scorpios who are single. There's no sense of you getting tore up about somebody who don't want to be there. OK. All right. So. Before I go, I'm going to pull an overall wisdom of the house tonight oracle message for you, and we're going to wrap this up. And we have deceit. Okay, this is the number 38. Three is a number of growth, like I was saying before. Eight is a number of um, desires, dreams, aspirations, adding them together. You get 11, which would be a pairing number, new beginnings. All right. Deceit. Okay. Okay. The author says, when you choose this symbol, carefully, um, be careful about your motives and making your choices. OK. There is one who has betrayed herself and all those who looked up to her. This is also a warning that someone may be stabbing you in the back, regardless of the circumstances of your question. I warn you about deceit. There will be a price to pay for betrayal in all forms. Only you know how much it will cost. That said, although the energy of betrayal can be seductive, 
you are stronger and you are forewarned. Okay. All right. So everybody can't go. <laughs> that is all. I, I, I believe that's going to what I'm going to title your video. Everybody can't go with you as much as you love them and you want them to. It's not their journey to take. Okay. So whatever you are embarking on, Scorpio, it's going to be rough. But I feel that the worst has been put behind you. And as soon as you drop that baggage of trying to take everybody with you, the journey will be a lot smoother. OK, that is your general message. Um, if this resonates with your situation, give me a thumbs up, comment, share it with the fellow Scorpio you feel needs to hear this message. Cross watchers, does this fit your situation? OK, also, um, like I was saying for um, other videos, other signs, other placements and other content, check over. Um, at Prophet Lex, my main channel, and in the community tab for um, sales and promotions there. All right, Scorpio. So until next time, love you. Take care.